Also happening today, El Paso County Commissioner set to discuss University Medical Center's multi-million dollar expansion project. The hospital district is asking for $345 million in certificates of obligation, a type of bond that you, the taxpayer, won't get a say in. But that could change now that a local group claims it receives enough signatures for a petition. Good morning, El Paso's Brianna Chavez is live now from UMC with what exactly is at stake. Good morning. Hillary, good morning. Well, for weeks now, officials with UMC has been hosting community meetings throughout the borderland to discuss their multi-million dollar project and why capacity should be expanded here within the hospital district after county commissioners asked them to publicly post their proposal. Now, county commissioners were originally set to discuss this to either approve the project, which could raise your taxes, choose to put it on the ballot for next May's election, or reject the proposal as a whole. Now, there is an item on the agenda today on this matter, but over the weekend, a local group, the Libra Initiative, posted on their Facebook page that they were able to receive 25,000 signatures needed to allow El Paso County voters to decide on the $345 million bond in a general election. That's according to a new law. Now, it's unclear this morning how that petition will change today's discussion, but I spoke with County Commissioner Ileana Olguin last week, who tells me many of her constituents expressed that they wanted to be able to have a voice in this decision. Many of them tell me that they support the hospital and they understand what the hospital is trying to do and they understand why these services are necessary, but they really do want to feel like they have a say in the process. Um, so I've had a lot of individuals uh, from my area um, tell me that they support the hospital, but they want to be able to vote on it. And coming up in the next half hour, we have UMC's response to that petition submission. But of course, ABC7 will be at today's commissioner meeting. Stay with us for all the latest updates on air, online, and through that KVIA news app. For now, we're live outside University Medical Center. Brianna Chavez, good morning, El Paso.